Today I am going to be telling you a Bible story of Peter and the crop of the cock. First, let's pray. Dear God, when I tell you Bible story of Peter and the crow of the cock, please let your Holy Spirit be with me. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Okay, so now you might learn a new thing from the story Peter and the crow of the cock. After the Last Supper, Jesus and his disciples walked to a small hill called Mount of Olives. Night was falling. The air was full of wonderful smells and sounds. Jesus knew that Jesus was going to betray him. Time was running out. He warned the disciples that when he was gone, they would find it difficult to go on obeying his rules. Peter spoke up saying that he would never turn away from Jesus. But Jesus said, children, tonight before the cock crows, you will deny me three times. Jesus then took the disciples to a garden called Gethsemane and asked them to wait while he went to pray. He was frightened, so he asked Peter, James and John to stay close by. When Jesus came back to his three friends, he found that they were fast Peter, can you stay awake for just one hour? He said. He went to pray again. And when he returned, he found the same thing. Three men chilled just fast asleep. They were snoring. <laughs> Jesus went off to pray for a third time. Once again, they were asleep. Come on, he said, get up, it's time to go. Suddenly, Jesus appeared behind him with a crowd of waves, sword and crunches. They were watching to see which man Jesus was kissed. Because that was the secret sound. Greeting, masters, Jesus said and kissed Jesus. the crowd, there was a scuffle. One of the men with Jesus drew his sword and cut off the ear of the high priest slave. Put your sword away, commanded Jesus. With one of the words of God, I put a stop all to this. But this is meant to happen. God wants it. When they heard this, his disciples turned and ran away. But Peter followed Jesus to the land cut pious. Well, the high priest questioned Jesus. Peter sat down aside in the courtyard. A man who happened to be walking by stopped and looked at Peter. You were with Jesus, weren't you? She said, no, no, not me, said Peter. You are wrong. When more people came by and said the same thing, Peter became so angry. I don't know the man, he shouted. And then it happened. The cock crowed. Peter remembered what Jesus had said. He knew that he had betrayed his very best friend. He cried and cried. So don't. So don't deny to Jesus. Jesus died on the cross for us. Jesus loves us. Jesus died on the cross for us because Jesus wanted to wash away our sins and he wanted to us, us to go on heaven. Okay? So please read Bible stories every day. We can't see Jesus. And Jesus got us Bible stories because Jesus can't be with us every time. But angels are with us. So I hope you enjoy the video and see you next time. Bye.